Hello guys, how you doing? I just wanted to show you guys uh, a little of the life in America. Life in America, especially for those of you who are not born in America, you come from a different country or whatever, or you, you're not even in America, but you, 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 you're curious to know what life is in America. So I'm about to go out. I'm just going out to some stores to buy some stuff. And uh, I'll show you how I go out. So I, I wear something, you know, it's a little cold, so I'll ha have a jacket on. But before that, what do I have on? Hmm, you're like, what is he doing? Are you going to walk out or anything like that? Nope. What is it? Yeah. Yeah. So I'm putting it on. Yep. Of course, I'm licensed. I have the, the license to carry it. And so now I wear my, my, my sweater on top. I'm going to sweater on top. Arrange the color of the shirt on there properly. And here we go. You will not know. You see me in the back, you will not know. You see me in the front, you will not know. Just in case. Just in case. Yeah, we we wish we don't have to be using all that. But, you know, people are evil. Some people, they might be possessed with a demon or they're just evil. They just want to end somebody's life in a crazy way. And that's not right. So you have the right to protect yourself. Maybe where you are, it's not, that's not the way to protect yourself. But maybe you can learn self-defense. It can help you a lot too. Karate, self-defense, you don't have to be in karate for years. You can take some few classes. You can pay an instructor, say, I just want to know some basics. Somebody attack me like this, how do I come out of it? You learn that. It goes a long way. And one thing about karate, just like any other thing, once you learn it, it remains in you for life. You can be 60 years old, the reflex of what you learn, it comes naturally. So please protect yourself. God will help you, but you have a responsibility also. Did you hear me? God will help you, but you also have a responsibility. The Bible says in Proverbs, the horse is made ready for the day of the battle, but victory belongs to God. The Bible didn't say just victory belongs to God, go to war. No. He said the horse is made ready. The horse, the animal, is made ready. God, didn't, God doesn't make the horse ready. People make the horse ready. What does that mean? That means people have to play the part. But victory belongs to God. Like I'm, I'm carrying this, I carry it many times. God protects me, nothing happens. You know, and if something happens, I pray to God to give me the victory. And also I would like to explain just because you have that, that doesn't mean you just, any little thing you bring it out, no. There are rules about it. Because people don't know that. People think, oh, everybody have God. If somebody do something, I'll bring it out. No, 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 no. It doesn't go like that. You'll be arrested. You'll go to jail for a long time. You use it as a last resort to defend your life and the life of others. So I just wanted to show you that clip. Again, I'm wearing a funny shirt. A guy in school. <coughs> a guy in school. They, uh, they asked him to do two plus two. He doesn't know the result. So he was on the ball struggling. Let me come closer. I pose the camera so I cannot zoom in. So they ask him, he doesn't know. His classmate was trying to help him. He said, four. Four. <laughs> the guy draw the hand. I love this. Somebody shared with me a long time ago, and I put it on show. It's just so funny for me. You have to find a way to laugh to enjoy your life. Okay? Again, this is not for everybody. This thing. You have to think about it. You can have it. It can hurt your family. You can have it have some responsibility. Okay, God bless you. Thank you, bye.